Did anyone say the compelling vision is to be the best? Anyone talk about that? Yeah, here's the question, why should I care? Why should I care that you wanna be the best? Tell me what it means for me. If you want me to change to help you be the best, why should I care that you wanna be the best? What does it mean? Does it mean I'm gonna get a bigger raise? Does it mean that I have more job security? Does it mean that my benefits are better? Does it mean that I have more opportunities for professional development? If I'm, a, if I'm just coming into the workplace today, is it gonna help me advance my career? If I've you know, been, been around since before there was dirt, is it gonna help me be more successful as I exit my career? Tell me what it means for me. Tell me what it means for me, because that's really what I wanna know, right? And so that, Creative tension comes when we can connect where the organization wants to go with where the individual needs to go. So why should a physician who refers to you be really excited about Epic? It's hard to say, right? Unless you know that if they get data, if they get information, it's going to help their practice be more profitable and be more sustainable. Okay, now I get it, show me that, show me that. So this requires some work because most of the things, to be honest, that you and I do to try to generate that tension, we throw out things that are important to us and it's really not important to everybody else. When I was in my hospital, I, I, one of the departments that I managed was food service. And I acquired the food service department, and, I, and so I made this decide, you know, I want to create this shared vision, this sense of excitement in the food service department. So every day as I was coming into the hospital, I stopped through food service. Every night before I left, I exited out through the, through the kitchen. I told him, you know, boy, your quality numbers are great. The, the cleanliness report, the hygiene report's perfect. Your budget is, oh, man, it's just amazing. After about three months, the food service manager came to visit me. And he said, Randy, I want you to know that, your, that the food service staff love having you as the person that we report to. In fact, they all say to a person that never, ever have they worked for someone that takes so much interest in what's going on in food service. You sort of feel this butt coming on, don't you? And he didn't disappoint. He said, but they've asked me to come to you with a message. Sooner or later, they'd like for you to taste the food. You see, what I was interested in is budget and quality and all those things. What they wanted to know is, tell me how the broccoli casserole tastes. We have to get that specific to share that vision that comes alive at that level.